Stay alert out there. What goods have you got? Understood. What are you doing with that damn technology? If you s another damned outsider, we ought to lock you up until we can ship you back to where you came from. I'm here escaping the Alps. Escaping them? Or spying for them? You should be fighting them. The only good Alb is a dead Alb. The clerics gave us the Alps. The Alps come here building their filthy converters. They foul our soil, kill our people. The only thing stopping these bastards, killing every last one of the free people, are the hooded crows. Sounds like you really hate the Alps. They won't stop until everyone is dead. It's always us berserkers who are taking losses. Ten hooded crows on the last patrol alone. All good men. Now, I'm asked to make up my ranks with outsiders? Why do you hate the Alps so much? They take so much elex. They've lost all their emotion. They're like machines. Killing machines. How messed up must you be to decide to do that? And how do they get the elex they're so pumped up on? They tear it from the ground. They take plants, animals, and people, and feed them into their converters. Every alb, every mutant, stands against nature. So you don't trust anyone? Our Founding Fathers knew well that you have to be really careful who you trust. They taught us we cannot give in to the temptation that awaits us outside our walls. And they did well. In the end, they were the first to see the deviant nature of technology. No one who has seen a mutant with their own eyes can deny that. It almost sounds like you envy the Alps' power. <laughs> a fully trained Alb commander, even an Elexator. They may be powerful, but true power is only found in the will to win and the fighting spirit. Have you got them? A fighting spirit, a will to win. What if I did, and I took Elex as well? Then you would be just another henchman. A soulless puppet for their cause. Is that what you want? To destroy Magalon as you destroy your soul? A strong sword. Our very effective combat magic. And a strong will. Those will save the world. They will stop the Alps. You want to kill Alps? I want to exterminate them. And every man, woman, and child on this planet should want to do the same. What about you? Are you ready to go and hunt some albs? This has nothing to do with me. Typical outsider. You'll come here and take from us, but you won't fight to save what we have. Let's see if you think the same when those animals come here looking to kill you. The Albs have been scouting ruins to the west of here. It could be they're searching for resources, but it could be they're scouting our patrol routes, or looking for somewhere to set up a base they can use to launch an attack on Goliath. Whatever they're doing, those Albs have had a free run of things for too long. I need someone to head out there and kill them. Teach me something. Yes.
What good? Understood. so good about the armor you supply? Quality, skill, years of practice technique. And as you go up through the ranks, you're eligible for different equipment. As a cultivator, you'll be confronted with different challenges to a warrior or a paladin. So for cultivator armor, I make sure to give you the freedom of movement needed for working in the fields. But a warrior's armor must be robust better able to absorb damage during combat.
sounds like you have a problem. Oh, I wish it was only one. But let's start with the Ison Clan promising me regular deliveries from the Valley of the Damned, and then failing to get them for me. It's time Master Thorold returned from his retreat to put this right. But like everyone else, it seems like he has plans greater than, say, making sure everyone gets fed. If we don't get that food, we'll be living on hope and fresh air. Then, why should you care if our warlords don't? Can I help? You? Well, I'm not one to turn down that sort of offer. My only motive is to keep people fed. If I'm going to achieve that, I need someone to talk to Angrim. I need someone to persuade him how serious the situation is. These warriors seem to think that fighting is the only thing that matters. But let's see them try fighting when they've not eaten for a week. Can you tell Angrim that's how bad it is? That if we don't start getting boxes of supplies, then the only thing he'll have to eat is boxes. I will speak to Angram for you. Thank you. My hunters are doing their best. But we can't get by without those food supplies from the valley. It sounds like these supply problems are getting you down. No guards for escorting the supplies here or to distribute them afterwards. Outlaws and clerics stealing some of what we do send. Yes, it's not just you. I had my armor stolen by an outlaw. Outlaws. The one thing you can trust them to do is to steal things. And you know where they take the things they've stolen? Well, if they're true outlaws, there is only one place they'll take them. Straight to Tavar and a share of the profit. Interesting to know. Where can I find this Master Thorold? Pilgrim has been gone for so long, I'm not sure anyone knows where he is. He announced that he needed to go into retreat for some higher purpose, and that was it. You left. All we know is that his leaving had something to do with Elix and Mana. But what exactly... I don't think anyone knows. Can we trade? Look around. Understood. Cinder sent me. Cinder? Is there another problem with food supplies? She hasn't received the resupply she needs, and nobody seems to know when she will. Didn't Jura sort this out? Or has his failure to fix things become my problem? What does Jura have to do with this? Jura was supposed to have sorted this out. Once more, it comes back to me to resolve this directly. Then, there won't be any more escorts for the deliveries. The last group I sent were killed by a troll. We haven't more men to lose that way. A troll killed your men? Good men. I've fought beside some of them. 
Being eaten alive was not the fate they deserved. I'll not send more men to their deaths. We have scant enough as it is. Cinda will have to deal with this problem herself. Tell her it is time she called on one of the other clans for help. The Ison clan will no longer risk lives for fish and meat. Thank you. Someone who is prepared to do something. When will the deliveries come? They won't. The men Engram sent to the valley are dead. And is he going to send more? No, wait. Let me guess. We don't have warriors to spare chasing farmers. How does he expect me to get supplies if he can't? He's got a host of warriors he can assign. I'm one person behind a counter. I could go for you. You? Well, I, I appreciate the offer, but if his men were killed, I can't ask you to go alone. Besides, it's not one delivery I need. It's regular supplies, and a lot of them. If the Ice and Clam won't help, one of the others will have to. Would you speak to Ragnar, Warlord of the Hooded Crows, or Cormag of the Hammer Clan? I'll have to hope that one of them can understand why this is so important. Technology away. Welcome, incomer. I hope you are being treated well. Goliath has always opened its doors to those who need shelter. But these are hard times, and war grows suspicions. As for me, I think the free people should work together in this war with the elves. Will I have trouble here? It will mostly be talk. People gossip about incomers. If you want the people here to trust you, then help them. Once they do, they will open their doors to you. You will have a place to stay. A chance to become one of us. And they will likely reward you for your trouble. We berserkers believe in second chances. It's your choice whether you take that chance or not. Teach me something. Sure.
Cinder needs your help. More trouble with the supplies? What can I do to help? She needs people to collect the food deliveries. I thought Angram had sent men to do that. The men he sent are dead. They were attacked by a troll. And more will die if our men aren't fed. Still, if Angram is worried about sending men, then there must be a real danger. I will send men to help Cinder. But if they're to go out there, then I want to improve their odds of survival. We recently captured some movement detectors from the clerics. They're being stored in the pit, ready for the Elix to be taken out of them. Get me one of those movement detectors, and I will give Cinder the help she wants. Isn't taking technology from the pit against the law? Sometimes, laws must be broken for problems to be fixed. Get me that detector, and I will help Cinder. Those are my terms. I have the movement detector you wanted. Excellent work. Now, my men stand a chance of seeing danger before they walk into it. Tell Cinder she can count on the support of the Hammer Clan. I will tell the men to be ready. Why did you wake me up? The Hammer Clan will get your supplies. They will? You convinced Cormac to help? Yes. Oh, you don't know what a relief that is. I was going crazy here. The least I can do is offer you some Alexit as thanks for your help. Give me what you think is fair. Well, the Isen Clan were due two payments. I guess they won't be claiming them now. There was 250 for the first, the same again for the second, so you get 500 Alexit. Teach me some. Of course. 